So this puffer only comes from one island in the entire world. 21 boxes total, that's a lot of fish. We hopefully you can see the difference. If you can't see the difference, I got see. And uh, last but not least, probably the coolest one in the box. Hey guys, welcome back to Coastal Scooters. I'm Coastal Smith, and in today's video, we are gonna be unboxing an insane amount of fish at Top Shelf Aquatics. It's gonna be around $15,000 worth of fish. Make sure you guys stay tuned because there are some pretty sick fish on this list that we're getting in these boxes. Uh, before we get into the video though, I did wanna give you an update on our mystery fish. Before I show you him, if you haven't seen the video, go ahead and check it out, it'll pop up right here. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you how he's doing. Okay, so this is Fred's tank, and the reason we call it Fred's tank is because this right here is Fred, which is our little porcupine puffer fish. Look at him, he is so cute. Oh, you just tried to eat my finger. Um, so that's Fred, the porcupine puffer. We made the tank for him. This is my mom's puffer. She's always wanted a puffer fish, so we went ahead and set it up for her. Um, in that tank as well, we have a powder blue, a clownfish, and there's a little damsel in here, which I'm trying to get rid of. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and show you the new mystery fish, which he's actually currently hiding, but hopefully he comes out here in a second. Uh, if you haven't seen the mystery fish video, be sure to check that out before I go ahead and spoil what we did end up getting. So here is our new fish, the Harlequin Tusk. He's doing absolutely amazing, eats really well, super active. I don't know why he was hiding there for a couple of minutes, but now that he's out and about, uh, we do need you guys to drop some name suggestions for him down below. The top like name suggestion will be his name because uh, we have not named him yet, but this is actually my favorite saltwater fish. So huge shout out to Eli for picking him out for me. Um, he looks great in here and I can't wait to see how big he ends up getting. Okay, now let's go ahead and head to Top Shelf Aquatics. We're gonna be unboxing all the fish. Let's go. Look at all these fish. Look at how many boxes, Chris. There's 21 boxes total. 21 boxes total, that's a lot of fish. We're gonna go ahead and get them put inside. Okay, so first thing, we're gonna open up all these boxes with Jed and Blaine here and make sure we got all the fish um, that we're supposed to have. Then we're gonna go through our full dip process where we That's cut open okay. the bags. Where we cut open the bags and we put them in through our dips and then put them out into the fish system. Okay, first we're gonna go through Quality Marine. We actually have three different, we have Quality, Sea Dwelling, and then Underwater World. Underwater World is coming later? Yes. Okay, it's coming later. Uh, but first things first, we're gonna do Quality Marine. Um, they have this beautiful packing list for us that actually has the number of the box. And then once you go to that number of the box, it'll tell you exactly what's in the box. So we can just check it off. So I'm going to go ahead and open these up and yell out the fish. And Jed over here sitting down is going to yell, yell out the fish. Uh, it's going to mark it down and make sure we got it. Hold on, I'm coming back. Please hold. Yeah, please hold. Oh, that is a Dude, big in there? bag. Okay, I'll show the small bags first. This guy's super awesome. We got a bat fish. Dude, look at the orange on the tree. Look at that orange coloration on that. It's kind of unfortunate they don't look like that forever. Yeah, when they get bigger, they're kind of ugly. Not gonna lie. Over the head. <laughs> Go ahead and put him off the side. This is a nice one as well. Gotta be a little careful with him because he is venomous, but we got a Fu Manchu lionfish. Look how cute he is. He's oh, so strong. Look at that Coolest lionfish on the face. In it. They have like a mustache on them. Oh, you can see the mustache there. Okay, box 10. What do we got? Yellow belly hippo. Bloodfire shrimp. You're wrong. Bloodfire shrimp. And a blue, yellow belly blue hippo. Look at that guy. Super pretty. And then last but not least for this small box, we got a yellow tail tamarind wrasse. So we're gonna go ahead and do this process like 20 times. I'll get some clips of some cooler fish that we're gonna pull out. Bag yes, sir. We got a Dejardini sailfin tank. Okay, off to This is uh, not the nicest one in the box, but oh, there he is. They're still really pretty. Oh, that's a nice size Definitely one. Definitely the be better than a regular sailfin tank. Um, now we got the cool, cool stuff. Where we got this one? Oh, the juvenile Achilles tank. My can't second really favorite tank. Look at that blue. Oh, lighting. it actually has uh, it has an orange spot on it. I can't really see because of the reflection. Dude, that's dope as you shit. See, you can see the orange spot coming through a little bit. We'll get it out of the bag, you see it. Okay. Yeah, next we got this one. A 
Okay, another day's Rodini sale. Okay. So you can really see the colors on this one. Oh, actually. this one's super this dark. This really nice. You can definitely the, see the striping The speckling on that. Oh, wow. there you go. That was a nice one. And then uh, last but not least, it's probably the coolest one in the box. We got a Fowry thing. That's like my third favorite tang behind the Achilles. I don't know if you'll be able also to Also known as a rainbow tang. We'll have to show you guys this one once we open it up and put it in the in the tub back there. All right, what do we got, what do we got? I don't know exactly what we got in each bag. We'll have to find out. Oh yeah, yeah, so this is gonna be the Achilles White Cheek Hybrid. So okay, so we saw the regular Achilles earlier. Is this a hybrid? It's bred with a white cheek, so you can actually Oh, it's like see perfect size too. You can actually see it's white cheeks coming in, more of a yellow color. Dude, that's a really nice one. Bag, but that's a nice. You'll one. see all these fish when we open them up as well. I just blinded the camera with my flashlight. Sorry, guys. Oh, it's a big one. Oh my what god! What is it? Rainbow bass. <laughs> I used to have one of these, but look oh, at how chunky nice. this one is. He's got a nice color. That's on. insane. What a pretty fish. And then we got a dude. This is a pretty awesome file fish. This is a half color file fish. Oh, the flame file? Flame file. These are really awesome. We don't get them too often. Come on this side. Now the label's in the front. other side. Well, we'll figure it out later. We'll figure it out later. All right, Jed, what do we got? This right here is a Ventralis Anthias. It will Can't really see focus. Oh my gosh, that's such a cool Anthias. I'll let you, I'll show you guys this guy when he's in the tank too. You'll be able to see he him better. Might go in the tank. He might go in my or house. in his tank. All right, Jed, what do we got here? This is a hooded flame rest. This is a male, so it's gonna have. Oh my god, Let's bro! Look at that. Let's we'll see. Do they Can't have purple in them? I didn't know they had purple. Look at the top. Oh man, fin. look at that. Look at the top fin. It's purple. Wow. So my dad actually has two females in his tank. So hopefully one turns into a male. But I'll get a better video of him when he's like in the tank. What a beautiful fish. You gonna get it, Jed? <laughs> yes. All right, we got a big fish in this box here. I'm saying it's gonna be the puffer. You say it's gonna be the clown tang. There's only two options. Unless for I some reason there's the a random fish I think in that's here. the only two options. But uh, let's open it up and find out. To be honest, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it because there's newspaper. So I already opened this to see it was a big fish, but you can't really see the fish. So no idea. All right. Yeah, we'll, we'll find out here in a second. <laughs> oh my god, it's the whole box. I don't even know what this is, but oh, I do know. I think I know what it is. We got a big midnight puffer fish. This oh, that's the that's not what I thought it was. Look at that guy. It, it's midnight, dude. It can't see anything. Dude, it's just, it's yeah. just black. Oh, let me get up. Oh, you can kind of see it. Can you see it? I just see light now. I can kind of see it. Oh, there we go, dude. He's jet black. He's right. Jet black. Bro, I had we got this giant, giant blonde naso. We're gonna put this in the oh, aquarium. Is it, it is a yeah. giant blonde naso. Oh, it's got nice streamers oh on gosh. too. Dude, he's huge. Dude, he's got streamers. That's even better. All right, let's take this into the boxing. Okay, now that we got all of our fish unboxed and counted, we got them in the sink here too. We have an overload of fish right now. We're gonna start popping them open, putting them into this, and then going through our dip process again. So we're just gonna roll a montage of that. Um, and I'll show you some of the cooler fish uh, that are in here. So let's go. Okay, now we're gonna go through our process of opening up all the bags and popping them into our dip. What is this guy? This is the worst blade. Oh, this is the it giant is. naso tank. Let me get you a sharper blade. Thank you, sir. Not that better. Oh, there we go. Can we see him? Wow. Let's make sure the spout is pointing down so it doesn't just pour all the spout. What a big fish in there. It's a like, perfect oh, wow. size. Yeah, what a perfect size. He's not too huge, not too small. He's got streamers on him. All right. What do we got next? Juvenile Achilles. Bro, I'm ready for this hybrid. Dude, he already has the orange spot. Look at that. That's like the smallest one I've seen with an actual orange spot. It's perfect. This is the hybrid one. Okay, it's this the is the one I was waiting for. This one looks pretty, pretty cool. He was a good size, too. Not too big, not too small. Oh, I 
That's perfect. Woo! Right. Look at that guy. The rays? The rays. Tied the rays the Get over Alright, now we got the midnight puffer fish. This is probably my favorite one of the day. So this puffer only comes from one island in the entire world. He's a lot smaller. Than, he's a lot smaller than the last one we had. Ready? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm ready. Jet black. Oh wow. Jet black. What a cool puffer fish. Look at the speckling on him too. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I had to show you guys this insane bimac anthus. Look at the coloration on that. You can dip it in the water. It's wow. like, well, that's crazy. Is it was just a female. Like this is one that's transitioning. You can see there's. He's not gonna let me pick him up. But there's. But, uh, yeah. There's still a lot of yellow on it there. So he's still in the process of transitioning. So that's gonna be a beautiful. What fish. a beautiful fish. All right. So this is a sailfin tank. It's a Dejardini. That's a red sea sailfin. So these two are from South Asia. This one's from Red Sea. It's a little dark, a little purple. Hopefully you can see the difference. If we can't see the difference, I got scammed. <laughs> I got scammed. Moment of truth. Didn't we get scammed? No, definitely Ooh, darker. Ooh, look at the, it's got almost longer fins on it too. Yeah, dude. Well, look, look at the shirt. patterns on that. That's so, really pretty. Regular, or no, sorry, regular Red Sea. You can definitely see yeah, how dark it is. Yeah, you can see, yeah. It's got more blue purple coloration to it. And the patterns are really nice. The speckling in the face is incredible. That's a really pretty fish. All right, we're getting down to the last few bags here. Jed's popping those in before we get to the three big, big fish. So let's pop in these last bags and I'll see you guys when we get to the big fish. Last, but certainly not least, we got our three giant bags here. This one ended up being a clown tang. Let me show you him. He's an absolute beast in there. Go ahead and just pour him out. This thing is a monster. Goes. Oh my gosh. Look at that beast. Dude, look at the streamers on that fish. What do we got here, Jed? We have a Mappa upper. What a beast. A little dark right now because he's stressed, but you can definitely see the lining in him where he's definitely going to be a beautiful fish. It's going to be closer to yellow, and he's all happy and settled in. Last but not least, big fish. That one's full. I don't want to squish the other fish. Hopefully they move. So this is our regular Naso Tang, which he's supposed to have streamers, but Jed says he doesn't see any. He's out. Yeah. This guy's really pretty, but he doesn't really have streamers like he was promised. We're gonna go ahead and pop in all of those fish, get them where they need to be, and I'll catch back with you guys when we're done with that. So that's pretty much what a typical Tuesday looks like for me and Jed at Top Shelf Aquatics. If you guys wanna see more fish like those, like updates on these unboxings, I actually do have a TikTok account. It's Colson's Critters on TikTok. And I've actually been posting uh, every single day, pretty much, of uh, one of the fish that we get in the shipment, which is some pretty cool stuff. So if you guys wanna see more updates like that, be sure to check out my TikTok. Let me know what your guys' favorite fish of the day was. Mine was probably the striped sweet lips. He had super good coloration. He was really nice size. Usually they come in pretty small and I honestly never seen one that big. So he was pretty cool to see. If you enjoyed this video, let me know and I can do another one where we have an even bigger fish shipment. But yeah, till next time, peace.